Hey guys, it's Kat. I'm going to be showing you in this video some of the things that I've been loving in this month of June. And um, stay tuned for that. So, I'm going to be showing you some stuff that I'm like currently loving in June. Some of these things actually I had them before this month. But I stopped using them for whatever reason. Whether I wasn't like in the mood to use it or I just didn't like it. And I didn't give the product a chance. But I was like, what the hey, let me start using them now. Because, you know, you can't just like throw away things that you bought and then like you're gonna return or whatever that's like wasting money so I was like let me just try and see if I like it and guess what I like it so this is why they're in this video um one of the things that I have not been using and I didn't buy actually I got it for Christmas was the uh, Clarisonic Mia 2 um I have the light pink one and when I first got it I got it with the regular head brush I mean the regular face brush um, and that was actually like breaking me out so I was like I'm not even using this or whatever but then I like started researching and they had like other brush heads so I tried the sensitive one which is the one that I have now and I absolutely love it it's great for my skin it's not too rough on it and it's perfect so I'm loving this right now um, something else that I'm actually loving is the Naked 2 palette by Urban Decay. Um, I've had this for a while too, but I wasn't really using it. Um, and one, like, I have like two colors that I really like, and it's this one right here, Foxy, which is like a great highlight color, and I'm loving Booty Call. Like, I just, inner corner greatness, love it. The only color that I really don't like as much is probably Blackout because I don't feel like it's as intense. Um, like you have to like keep layering it and layering it on top in order to get like that really black intense color. But other than that, I'm loving this palette. Another thing that I'm actually loving right now is um, this L'Oreal liner and it's called 12 Hour, 12 Hour <laughs> Infallible. The super slim liquid eyeliner and it's like look how slim this tip is it's like incredibly tiny and it's perfect when you want to have like a great line in your lash in your um, lid <laughs> anyways another thing that I'm loving which is like great if you have oily skin is this NARS um, primer eyeshadow primer and let me tell you this is no joke like this is really good my lids are immensely like super oily and when I mean like super oily it's like you rub the baby oil all over my lids because you know I don't know why it just happens so I was like in a, I was like looking for um, primers that wouldn't like make my eyes oily I was using actually the Urban Decay primer potion for a while you know and it's like it was great but after a couple of hours, like, you can still see, like, maybe my eyeshadow coming coming out or whatever. So I was like, I need something else. And I saw this, and I'm like, let me try it, and I love it. This actually makes my eyeshadow stay on for, like, a really long time. So I'm loving this. Another thing that I have, which is a sample of the HD Powder um, by Makeup Forever, and it's a sample, and... I've been using this non-stop for the month of June and let me tell you I still have a lot of products. Um, I'm waiting for this to be done because this makes me look flawless. Like I have like some imperfections. I don't know if you can tell in this video or not, but like I have like blemishes all over my face. And um, when I do put on my foundation, which that's one of the great reasons also because of foundation, but this powder doesn't make me look oily at all. Like it literally leaves me matte. I love it. I love this powder. So when this runs out, I'll be getting the full product. Another thing that I'm loving, which is amazing, is Amazing Cosmetics Anti-Aging Face Primer. It's a little dirty because it's like it has foundation on it. But this is really good also if you have combination skin or just like oily skin because this is oily free oil free <laughs> oily free this is oil free and um it also keeps my face kind of like matte and very soft it closes the pores and then it also has an anti-aging um serum in it i guess because it says anti-aging but 
but it's really really good I love this um, one last thing that I'm loving, oh, actually, so one other thing also. One thing that I'm loving <laughs> is this MAC um, blush, and it's called Fleur Power. Um, I guess it's like Flower Power, and I'm actually on wearing it right now. And the only thing about this is that it's like so pigmented. So you need to, like, probably if you want to wear it and you want a softer look, probably put on a little bit, not so much. Um, because it's so pigmented, but I love it. It like gives the perfect flush to your skin and you look nice and like you're glowing or whatever. And then the last thing that I'm loving is I'm actually wearing it right now is the Sally Hansen um, sticker. <laughs> Nail effects. Um, no, salon effects. Nail stickers. <laughs> there you go. Um, and it's like, it's supposed to last for like two weeks and it's been one week already so so far so good um maybe i'll do a tutorial on how to use it it's like so simple if you use it the correct way you can actually maybe have like two times um manicure so maybe i'll do a video about that i don't know yeah. if you guys want to just request it and i'll definitely do one but these are definitely my June favorites. Um, let me know if you have any June favorites or if you like any of these products. They're amazing and I thought maybe I should just tell you guys what I liked and that's about it. I'm definitely going to be doing more videos so stay tuned for that and yeah I hope you guys liked it. Thanks. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. Bye.